A cochlear implant is designed to provide a sensation of sound to, to adults who are severely to profoundly deaf in both ears and who find it very difficult to communicate in everyday life. It's not a perfect solution and the outcome can vary greatly from one person to another. For that reason, we do a fairly thorough assessment to find out whether a person is suitable for cochlear implant and whether it's something that they actually would like to have. The fruit lies on the ground. Uh, the fruit. Um. Assessment involves seeing our audiologist, our rehabilitation team and our medical team, we look at each patient individually. Can I have your hearing aid, please? When you meet the audiologist, they will look at your hearing aids, make sure they're working, will test your hearing, measure the benefit from the hearing aids, and do any more intensive audiology tests that you might need. When you meet the speech and language therapist, they will look at why you want to have a cochlear implant, about how your deafness affects your communication in everyday life, and look at how the cochlear implant might change that. We need to make sure that your expectations will actually meet what we think we can offer you with a cochlear implant. Tell me about your hearing loss. When did you first notice it? Um, about 10 years ago. And did it affect one ear or both ears? It both ears. The surgeon will talk to you about the history of your deafness and look in your ears and try to establish a cause for the hearing loss if that's possible. This is the result of your hearing test. Mm -hmm. Normal hearing is around 20 decibels and your hearing thresholds in both ears are way below the normal thresholds. You also meet our radiology team where you'll have an MRI scan and a CT scan. The MRI scan will look at the nerves of hearing and the CT scan will look at the more bony parts of your inner ear. Yeah, we try to do all of the assessment on one day but occasionally we need to do some additional tests and you may need to come back on another day to have those done. After you've completed your assessment all the results will be discussed in a multidisciplinary team meeting and we come out with a recommendation whether we think a cochlear implant would be suitable for you or a different type of implant would be more suitable. We might find that simply just adjusting your hearing aids might be the solution for your hearing problem. But at the same time you will need to make your own mind up about whether this is something that you'd like to go ahead with. So it's, it's quite a big commitment from you yourself. And I'm happy to tell you that we would be able to help you with a cochlear implant. That's, that's really fantastic news, thank you. We think as a team that your left ear would be more suitable for to receive the cochlear implant. At the outcome appointment, the surgeon would go through the preparation for surgery, the surgical procedure, and what to expect following the surgery. So cochlear implant surgery nowadays is relatively routine, straightforward surgery. Like any operation, there are some risks, and at your outcome appointment, we will be discussing with you your individual risks. If you decide that you would like to go ahead, we will arrange for a surgery date, and you will have a preoperative anesthetic assessment done to check your suitability to have a general anesthesia. The final step prior to having surgery is to have an appointment with our audiologist to choose which type of implant you would like to receive. In our program, we are proud that we offer all major implant manufacturers, and if there is no clinical indication for a specific type of implant, the decision is entirely yours which type of implant you would like to go for.